Hey beautiful and welcome back to my channel. My name is Tiffany Okafor and I empower women to claim the love, peace of mind, and happiness we deserve. In today's episode, we're gonna be discussing the question, should I go vegan? Stick around if you wanna know if a plant-based diet is right for you and I'm gonna share my perspective with you right after this. If you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on this juicy content that I dish out every single week, okay? <laughs> and if you haven't already, make sure to check out the description box down below. I will include a link for you to purchase your very own copy of my best-selling book, Bitchy, if you haven't already. Make sure you go ahead and cop that. It will change your life. <laughs> so, should you go vegan? Should you eat a plant-based diet? The short answer is you have to figure that out by yourself. But what I will do, because we're here, and only because we're here, is share with you my own perspective. I'll share with you what it's like for me eating a plant-based diet. So first of all, what is a plant-based diet? What is this whole vegan thing, right? So a lot of vegans, they eat a plant-based diet and they don't you know, wear any animal products like leather. Me, on the other hand, I just eat a plant-based diet. And what that means is I don't eat any meat and I don't eat any dairy products. Now, let's talk about some pros. For me, the main pro is that my digestion is fast and steady. You hear me? Fast and steady digestion. That is something that did not happen when I was eating dairy and meat. Say for example, I would eat a taco that I would make at home, like with ground beef, sour cream, cheese, all that stuff that is so delicious, right? I would add all that stuff to my taco and then it would take me about three to four days to process, if you know what I'm saying. Three to four days for that taco to move its way from you know down my throat, down in my tummy, to out of my body. And now when I eat taco, I still make taco. I mainly use like beans and veggies, and sometimes I'll throw in like some fake meat just for the texture and the consistency when I'm missing that meat. Um, it flows through me like this, like you know what I mean. It. I eat it, I consume it, my body takes in the nutrients it needs, and then the rest is waste. Basically what I'm trying to say is that I'm never backed up on this diet. It's just a good feeling knowing that you don't have a whole bunch of stuff trapped all up in your body, you know? Um, and what that also leads to for me is another pro, which is my skin is way clearer. My skin is clear. Now, I've mentioned before that I've done uh, I've been on all kind of diets and I do that just to test it out for myself to see which one is truly best for me. If you look back at one of my old videos, uh, it's called how to deal with petty people. You can see in that video that my skin is not as clear as it is now. In that video, I had gone back to eating uh, meat and dairy for a short period of time because I was just craving it. And you know, I got a little thicker and my um, skin got a little unclear. But now we're back. Now I'm back, you know? Um, and that leads me into a third pro. You automatically lose weight when you eat a plant-based diet. And that is because of what I just mentioned in the first tip, your digestion just kind of flows. So you, you eat, it goes in, it comes out. There's nothing extra that's trapped in your body. And that is only if you eat a healthy plant-based diet because you can eat a plant-based diet and eat only potatoes, only french fries and crackers. That is still a plant-based diet, but it's not healthy and you might actually gain weight if you do that. But anyway, I digress. So my three pros, like I said, my digestion is easy, my skin is clearer, and for me, I automatically just shed pounds. Those are three, those are three. There are way more and if you want more information, more tips, or you wanna ask me any questions about eating a plant-based diet, just leave those questions down below in the comments and um, I'll respond. Now let's go over to some cons. What are the cons of eating a plant-based diet? 
So for me, when I first went vegan, I did it cold turkey. And most people don't recommend this, but that's how I do things, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm a gangster. Not really, I'm not a gangster. But for me, I did it cold turkey. So I went from eating all the meats, all the dairy, one day to the next day, eating none of the meats and none of the dairy. <laughs> and what that did for me was, um, it kept me in the bathroom for a very long time. I mean, what happened is that like I, you know, increased my fiber intake by like 70 to 100% basically, because I was not eating as many beans or, you know, tofu or, or other, you know, um, plant-based protein sources. So that just my fiber intake went like this, my water intake went like this, and I just was like losing weight so fast that it just, you know, I was in the bathroom a lot. So it was kind of violent for me. That was like one con, and that doesn't happen to everybody, but that happened to me because I, you know, I went vegan cold turkey. Another con that I can think of is, um, you know, the first time that I went vegan, it, um, was like shocking to a lot of people <laughs> and a lot of people had a lot of questions and a lot of weird things to say um but what i'll say is that one con which is not an issue for me right now um, but it was when i first went vegan is that people start to watch what you eat on a regular basis like they'll look at your plate and they're like are you eating potatoes i thought you said you were vegan because like even though being vegan and eating a plant-based diet is something that is becoming so much more familiar to people now, people still have questions and still don't fully understand what it means to eat a plant-based diet. So you may get weird questions like, why are you eating potatoes? Or why are you eating this? Is that vegan too? Is that vegan? Is that vegan? Is that vegan? Is that vegan? So just expect, if you're in a circle full of people who don't eat a plant-based diet, just expect them to be very curious and perhaps ask you a lot of questions about what it is that you're eating. And that might be a con for some. It was for me in the beginning, um, but I'm used to it now, so it's all good. Let's see if I can think of a third con. Um, I really can't. There's so many amazing things that happen in your body, in your skin, as a result of eating a plant-based diet. So for me, it's the diet that I love the most. It's the diet that I know is the healthiest. But for you, you have to do more research and figure out for yourself what is good for you. And that's it. Like I said, if you have any questions, leave them down below in the comment box comment section and i'm happy to answer them for you i shot this video today in the kitchen because i'm about to eat taco which is why i mentioned taco so much in this video thank you so much for watching i love you and i appreciate you more than you can even possibly imagine until the next video peace